Hi guys, charity shop gold or garbage. Thursday the 2nd of February 2023. Went to Chipping Sodbury today. I tried hard to resist, but I did end up buying three items. I had to buy this. I mean, it's just such fun. Consult the educated monkey. It's German. I can't pronounce it. Keine Osse Heine, I think it says. Apologies for my pronunciation. Since 1991, so it's not a it's not a vintage item, even though it's nice tin plate. It does say collectors and nostalgia item not suitable for children's toy for safety reasons and i think that says not for children under 14 years old cost me two pound fifty granddad what are you doing spending all that money i just love it you point the feet at two numbers and it will give you their product. In other words, when you multiply them together. So if we go nine and six, we get 54 in the box. And over here, square, if we go, uh, where are we? One leg on the square and the other on the nine, we get nine nines are 81, or nine squared is 81. 8 squared 64, 7 squared 49, 6 squared 36, 5 25, 4 16, 3 9, 2 4, square root of 1 is 1. And 1 times 12 is 12, 1 times 11 is 11, and so on. I just thought it was wonderful. So it's pivot there, pivot there. Obviously, there's a pivot oh, just about there. I can feel the pin. And then we've got this sliding piece goes up and down the middle, which is also pivoted there. So that's the pivoting. There's a hole there and a hole there. It looks like something possibly might be missing. Possibly. Maybe there was something to stop him falling off the front. Maybe. I haven't really got a use for it. I just had to buy it. Got a nice stand. And it's all made from tin plate, as I'd call it. So I think that's rather nice. Don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I like it. And then, yeah, a couple of those, um, I call them clip together kits. You don't really clip them together as such. Slot together would probably be a better word. This one's an RNLI lifeboat, Royal National Lifeboat Institution, RNLI. Build and play contains two characters and a lifeboat. I did wonder whether it'd be one of those things I could possibly replicate on a 3D printer. Just because I find that interesting to try and do. It's probably more pieces than I want to print. Not suitable for use in water. <laughs> okay.
Yeah, 3D printing it might be a bit of a problem. I'm going to very carefully punch the pieces out so we had the silhouette left. I could try and photocopy the silhouette. I expect the little fingers will break off as I'm pushing the bits out, so it probably won't, won't work like that. Depends how careful I am. Anyway, that's one of those things that I put in the back of the car to keep myself occupied when Nanny's visiting her friends or shopping or in the hospital or something like that. Looks like that slots together. Hmm. Okay. And then finally, I think I did one of these not so long ago. Oh, did I say how much that was? That was a pound I paid for that. There it is. Pound. And then this one, sort of thing I normally pay a pound for anyway, was one pound fifty. Never mind. Say, ninety-nine percent sure I've done one not so long ago. But that'll go in my stock in the car, keep us occupied. So both of them in the car. And uh, yeah, I'll show you stuff that I didn't buy that I managed to resist. <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you want more information, check down below in the video description. If you like this video, you might like this one up here. And if you want to subscribe, you can check out my channel over here. Up here is my latest video on my channel, and down here is a video playlist associated with the video you've just watched. Thanks again for watching.